Hi everyone, welcome back to One Step Adventure. I'm Steve. Oh my god, look at me. It's cold and wet. I'm at DCA. Tonight I have two missions. Number one, I still have the festival holiday. I have two tabs here. So I want to use this because I think this is the last time I'm going to be here for this week. And the event ends on the 8th. So I had to finish this. Also, my friend Jenny Chang, Miss Hermes, uh, her son's turning four. Ethan, happy birthday. His favorite Disney movie is Car. So I got to come here for some awesome gift. The Car merch is going to be at DCA. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel over here and turn on the notification bell so you know the day and time I release my video. Also, check out my other YouTube channel, Mr. Jen Only One. That is a focus on beauty and lifestyle over here. So go check it out. And let's go and see what we can find here. Okay, it's supposed to be 30% rain tonight, but it looks pretty wet right now. And people's leaving, but I'm coming in. Like I say, I'm here on a mission. I'm here to search a perfect gift for my friend's kid. He's turning four next weekend. Okay, this is the last time you're gonna see the tree here at DCA. After January the 8th, it will be gone. We won't see the tree for another 12 months. Well, actually 11 months. Because they usually have a tree out right after Halloween. Wait, before Halloween. So, yep, say goodbye. So it's definitely raining right now. I don't want to wear poncho or carry umbrella, so I wear hoodie. Hopefully I won't get too wet. Yeah. It says 30% raining, but it feels like very heavy rain right now. So I don't know what's going on. Not good. Maybe this is a bad choice. Maybe I should get a poncho myself. Oh my god, it's actually raining pretty heavy. I think I'm gonna be soaking wet. Well, let's make this trip fast. Uh, I think first let's eat something. I have two tap left. I just don't know what I'm gonna eat though. Obviously, I tried almost all of the food here when I first started in November. So, I think I can pass the twist of the traditions because I don't really like the mac and cheese. I'm not in the mood for sweet right now. I remember the sweet potato stuff, corn muffin was really good. Consider tonight is what, Wednesday night and raining. There's a lot of people here. A lot of people here. Bruise and bites. Uh, no, a pass. Oh, maybe I'll go to the the paradise, garden paradise. Well, I totally forgot the name. Yeah, they usually have food there too for a little bit smaller portion. So, yeah, I can't believe it's already January the 4th. Time just gone by so fast. Oh my god, my camera is all wet. Sorry about guys. It's hard to film this when it's wet. So, yeah, I think I'm going back to the paradise garden. I think that's the name. I totally forgot the name because it's. You can eat there, so I won't get wet. Okay, so I used my last two tickets from the Festival of Holiday Paradise Garden Grill, and I got the Impossible Meatball Soup. A prepa? I, sorry, I butchered that name really bad, sorry. So first, let's try the soup. There's a little lime in here. So I'm gonna put a little lime in the soup. Raining day soup is so yummy. Wow, it's warm. Hmm. It's actually really, really good. So it's vegetable soup. Um, very rich in the vegetable flavor. You don't even need salt. There's a lot of flavor in there. Now let's try the meatball. This meatball is humongous. Let me show you guys that. Oh my god. I cannot tell it's not me. It tastes like meatball. Very juicy, very tender. A lot of flavor in there. Definitely not dry. You know, sometimes meatball can be very, very dry. I put a little bit of hot sauce here. I think at the Paradise Garden Grill, it's the only place you can find hot sauce. I could be wrong, but... Mmm. Wow. Okay, now let's try this uh, chicken upper. Look at that. Try without any spicy sauce. 
Oh, oh it's made with a mud stove, maize stove. So kind of like bread, I think. Um, but what I like about it is when you bite it in, there's a lot of texture and this kind of crunchiness in there. So it's really, really good. It's not all soggy. Mm. Hot sauce is everything. Mm. All right, we are in Cars Land now. One thing about Disney, right after the this Christmas decoration come down, everything gonna look so empty. Okay, let's check out the first store right here, Sergeant Supply Hunt. Hopefully, we'll find something cute. I'm pretty sure we'll find something fabulous here for him. You forgot? Oh yeah. That looks good. Okay, I'll probably take that. Thank you so much. I think he might like that. Oh, these are very nice too. Heavy metal matter. So this is $24.99. Oh my god, this is so cute. But this is a five years old. Say try me. What do you mean try me? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my gosh. This is cute. Oh my god, this is so cute. And they even have this one, the jumpsuit. Oh my god, Dino Park. Whoa, I think this is a kid's heaven. Right? They love all that. Oh, you can buy them individually. Let's see how much they cost. $10 each. Oh, not cheap. Oh my god, I think kids go crazy for this. Oh, this is the bucket. There's a five cars in here. The police, the fire truck. Oh, oh my god, I forgot his name. I forgot his name. I forgot their name. Oh my god, I'm so bad. Anyway, yeah. I don't think I ever come here before, so... Lighting McQueen, that's his name. Oh. Pillow and blanket. $39.99. I don't think kids like that. They want toys. So many cute stuff here. I think I found what I want. I'm gonna trust her. She said this is a popular item. So this is it. Let's go pay for this baby. Alright, thank you so much for watching my video tonight. I hope you enjoy. I'm taking you to DCA on a rainy night with a little something really nice. And we were able to get some cute stuff for my friend's kids. If you have any recommendation for four years old boy who like cards, leave a comment below. And I really appreciate that because I don't think one gives enough. Make sure that you follow my social media, Mr. Jin Only One, and check out my other YouTube channel, Mr. Jin Only One. That YouTube channel is focused 90% skincare, 10% lifestyle. And of course, don't forget to check out my skincare brand, Ibu Beauty. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.